Carolina and Company Live is sponsored by the businesses, organizations, and groups featured in this program. The views and opinions expressed do not necessarily reflect that of WPDE ABC 15, WWMB CW 21, or its employees. You're watching Carolina and Company Live. Your source for fun, entertainment, and events. With your host, Cecil Chandler and Amanda Sellers. If it's happening in the area, it's on Carolina and Company Live. And hello, everybody. Welcome to Carolina and Company Live. All right, we've got a special show lined up today because when you come to the Grand Strand, if you live here, you've got to take in some of the shows. I'm talking about Christmas shows. That's what we're talking about. That's today. right. All kinds of great entertainment here at the beach. You definitely want to come check it out. And that's what you're going to get a little preview today of just what we have to offer on the Grand Strand. But first, let's check out our weather. First warning weather with meteorologist Kevin Jacobs. Well, after a chilly start this morning with sub-freezing temperatures, especially along the border belt, some mid and upper 20s out there for Lumberton, Lornburg, and freezing temperatures over into the Bennisville area. But this afternoon, we're on a warming trend. It's underway right now for this Monday. Lots of sunshine for today, but then the clear cold conditions are back by Tuesday morning. So as you head out to school and work, that second day, after an extended holiday weekend and then we're warmer by Wednesday and Thursday above normal for the last week of November because high pressure is in place. This is going to provide for dry conditions, sunny skies and warmer temperatures as high pressure moves to the east. That, of course, is going to give us a little bit of moisture offshore, but many of us will stay dry. That flow will continue to drive up those temperatures by midweek. Out ahead of our next weather makers, this cold front will approach the area by Thursday. So some rain associated with this front likely across the Tennessee Valley by Thursday morning. But as it moves towards the east, it will increase our rain chances, but small chances for Thursday night into Friday morning. So do not expect any widespread rainfall with this particular weather maker. Here's a look at your temperatures for today, the short term, your Monday afternoon into the low to mid 60s. Many of us will top out around 63 for daytime highs. Burst of sunshine for this Monday. And sunny days are certainly ahead with your Grand Strand seven day forecast each and every day, mainly sunny skies through Thursday, Friday, we'll have a little bit more cloud cover out ahead of that front. But your weekend, never too early to look towards the weekend with sunny skies and slightly cooler conditions. Wednesday, you have a coat on this morning. You would not need it by Wednesday. Certainly milder mornings are ahead and much warmer afternoon highs into the 70s. But we know that warm up is not going to last forever. The first day of December is coming up this week and we'll have seasonal highs as we approach the weekend into the low 60s. Weather is brought to you by A&I Fire and Water Restoration. Welcome back to Carolina and Company Live. All right, today is November the 27th and it is also Cyber Monday. So online shoppers, today is the day they estimate Six billion, billion. dollars on yes, Cyber Monday. That's unbelievable. And it it's is. also Bible Week and Pins and Needles Day, just okay. to mention a few. All right, let's check out whose birthday we got today. You know this guy, 1955, Bill Nye, the science guy. That's, that's what everybody right. calls him. He's 62 years old. On TV from 1993 to 1998, and uh, he appeared in three episodes of TV's Numbers. All right, 1957, Caroline Kennedy, 60 years old, daughter of former President John F. Kennedy, and Neil Diamond was inspired to write his song, Sweet Caroline. That was an inspiration. A lot of people didn't know that. That's okay. right. 1976, Jaylee White. Jaleel. Fort Jolie. Jaleel. Jaleel. Steve Jaleel. Urkel, buddy. He got to learn to spell better. <laughs> 41 years old, Steve Urkel from TV's Family Matters. And before acting, he did a series of commercials at the age of three. All right. All right. Today in history, go ahead. You remember this, right? 1934, yes. The, the U.S. bank robber 
George Babyface Nelson was killed by FBI agents near Barrington, Illinois. All right, 1967, Capitol Records released the Beatles' Magical Mystery Tour album in the U.S. And if you got an original copy of that album, it's worth some money, too. Yeah. All right, how about this for facts now? Extreme Makeover. This is what happened to it. Everybody knows about that show. The home one, Yep, right? the home one, right. Home edition. They drove so many families into bankruptcy and foreclosure, they had to start downsizing their houses because they couldn't pay the taxes on them. Can you imagine? Can you imagine? Build me a beautiful house, then I can't pay the taxes. Hey, somebody didn't think that through. I know. I That's from the uh, know-it-all department. I forgot what I'm doing today. It's a Monday, but we'll try to get by with that. We've got a great show lined up. <laughs> Hang on. We'll be right back. Welcome back to Carolina and Company Live, talking about Christmas shows along the Grand Strand. And you can't forget about Pirate's Voyage. We went this past summer, and I'm telling you, what a fantastic time. My kids absolutely loved it, and I heard Christmas there is even better. It's amazing. I took my grandkids last year, and it's, uh, right. you know, L.H. McCoy had been there for a long time setting things up. He's still working with them a little bit. We've All got right. a couple of big people with us now. Let me make sure I got these names right. I haven't got them right. Bob? Bob Cratchit, yes. All right, I got that I'm right. sure you've heard of me once or twice. Right. Yes. <laughs> and this is our Captain Red Scarlet. Captain Red Scarlet. Yes, okay. doesn't she look gorgeous? She yes. does look gorgeous. I'd probably talk to her. You? I, I know you would. <laughs> I'm just kidding, just kidding. All right, let's talk a little bit about, you know, let's talk about the Christmas show because this is an amazing show. It really is. We have so much to offer there. We have uh, amazing acrobatics. We have high diving, fire juggling, our live nativity, and all while you're enjoying a, an amazing Christmas feast. All right, fantastic. And now, the show normally, um, you guys do how many shows a day normally? Now, Christmas, is that more? Uh, Christmas, it's, it's about the same. Okay. Uh, we, we, we don't do as much as we do in the summertime because sure. there's, there's not as many people here. Yeah, look uh, at some of this. This but, is amazing, uh, some of the stuff that goes on. It absolutely look is. Look at this. That's right. Those are our toys right there. We have toys that come to life. There's our feast, and uh, there's so much there. There's our Captain Scrooge, and there's the spirit of Christmas there that guides him to know that. the true meaning of Christmas and Very our live nativity. Yes. And it's all there. All right, now, Captain, what, what, what do you do in this show? I get to be around with my crewmates. I get to dance around. I get to just enjoy the holiday feast with everyone and just make memories. All right, and now Scarlet. So this is the red I, team. Yes. <laughs> All right, now, but there's also there is there, there, there is her counterpart that is uh, Captain Le Green uh, uh, for the Emerald Crew. Mm -hmm. uh, I know you don't really like hearing his voice that often. They don't hear his name. I, I know, but, uh, but well, we see who won the interview. That he got left behind. Well, exactly. So. Well, she, she is a little prettier than he is. Uh, but uh, but you'll also see the competition between Red Scarlet and Captain Le Green uh, as they battle for the Christmas treasure. All right, now the shows run. One of the shows are right now. Uh, the shows are, if you check out piratesvoyage.com, you'll see right. our schedule. Uh, it varies from week to week. Well, what's so amazing is watching these people bounce on these trampolines. Oh, yes. And the way they do the acrobatics. It's just, I'm, can you do that? A little. Can you do that? <laughs> she does. Really? If, if you she come does. and you see our aerial act, she is uh, actually our featured aerial, aerialist there. Wow. Are you, yes. Can you do that? Oh, no. Goodness, okay. no. No, they're, 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 I just speak and, uh, and uh, zip line and sword fight and those kind of things. I, I wish I could do what they do, but they train for years and years to be able to bring the amazing tradition to the beach. Yeah. It's, it's absolutely incredible. It really is something that you definitely need to go see. So visit them, Pirates Voyage. PiratesVoyage.com. You right. can book your tickets right now. And definitely a show you do not want to miss. It's a the great Christmas show. time. It's perfect. It Thanks really for is. being with us. Thank, Thank you for having, having us. We appreciate y'all being here. Of course. Thank you. All right. All right, you guys, stick around. We'll be right back.
And welcome back. The show is all about Christmas shows along the Grand Strand. If you're visiting the beach or if you live here, you've got to check out some of these shows. And now right. we're talking about the Alabama Theater's Christmas show. That's right. Been going on for over 20 years, and we've got Allison with us to tell us a little hey. bit about. Tell us about the Alabama Theater and how you guys celebrate Christmas. Well, we do the South's grandest Christmas show. We run all of November and December through the 31st. Um, we just like to celebrate the tradition of Christmas. So we've got lots of the music that everybody knows, all the traditional Christmas songs. Um, we've got families that have been coming for years. You know, the kids came when they were really little, and now they're in college, they're teenagers. And uh, they've been coming back, you know, year after year. It's a family tradition. Uh, we just, we just invite you to come, bring your family, and come spend it with our great family at the theater. Great looking video, y'all. Just, did, yeah. this is great looking video. Absolutely. Yeah, that's yeah. our opening number there. Yeah, all right, now and, you got and they're going to be able to, you know, they're going to hear songs. Everybody can sing along. It's, it's just yeah, a fun, absolutely. joyous time. It's absolutely. Something, it's kind of full participation is what you want. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> definitely, definitely. There's even some uh, audience participation in there oh, where right. some we get some people right, now, to have some fun. All the singing and all the cheer. What's your favorite Christmas song in this show? Um, I get to sing the first Noel uh, oh, towards the end of the show, which is a nice, nice. Really yeah, nice. traditional yeah. song, which is really nice. Yeah. I really enjoy getting to do that. Now, how long have you been with Alabama Theater? You know, I just joined the cast last year. Last yeah. year? Yeah. Wow. Yeah, where yeah. Are you I moved here from, from? Uh, Pigeon Forge, Tennessee. My husband and I are both performers. We were performing there, and then I got the job offer here to come to Alabama Theater, and I'm so glad I did. It's a great place to work, and I really enjoy it being in the show there. So. Yeah, you got a lot of great people that work out Absolutely, there. Absolutely, yeah. 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 We're a Greg big old family. And, yeah, tell, tell Greg uh, I said hello. <laughs> I will. He's yes, on these this ornaments. This is not the news. This is not the news. <clears> He's on the you. ornaments here. He's these on are the gifts from you guys. Wow. Yeah, a little you. hashtag Greg rolls there. Oh. I love yeah. it. Thank you very well, much. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Appreciate it. Now, tickets for Alabama Theater, and when do you guys start your Christmas shows? We start at November 1st. We run through December 31st. We have tons of matinees. We always do six nights a week at 7.30, but we've got lots of matinees, about 20 matinees. Uh, this year. So come in the afternoon, come in the evening, uh, call the box office. It's 272-1111 or you can go to alabamatheater.com. Find out all about it. Yeah, so. yeah. Well, it's Find a great show. You need I've to been know. to this one, too. I've been to this one, too. But wish you a lot of luck. And we're glad Thanks you're so here. Thanks so much. Thank yeah. you. I'm happy here. to be glad here. Glad to have you in Myrtle Thank Beach. Thank you. Yeah, awesome. yeah, I'll be here for a while. Fantastic. <laughs> Sticking around. Right. Yeah. Have a great Christmas. Nice. Right. Thank you, guys. Uh -huh. All right, we got more coming up. We'll be right back. Stay with us. Welcome back to Carolina and Company Live, a special show talking about Christmas shows along the Grand Strand. And we can't forget the House of Blues. Man, they've got concerts <laughs> all the time, and Christmas has just as many. That's right. they got a lot coming up. Dawn's with us here. You're going to talk about some of the things coming up. And uh, the first big deal is Cyber Monday. What are y'all doing with that? Well, oh. today you can get some great deals on some concert tickets. So oh, really? we've got shows happening. We like to say that don't let the holiday end at Christmas. We've got shows the 27th, 28th, 29th, 30th, and 31st. So that whole week between Christmas and wow. New Year's, you can come out and rock out with us. We've got some tickets as low as $6.50 today for Cyber Monday. Oh. So you can come and see our rumors uh, tribute to Fleetwood Mac show that we have oh. right after Christmas or our ACDC uh, tribute Thunderstruck that's coming up. So. 
we've got some great tickets, and that's cheaper than a movie ticket. So you can come out and see a live show, bring your family and friends that are in for the holidays. But just go to Ticketmaster.com or HouseOfBlues.com slash Myrtle Beach, and you can get some great ticket deals. Now, that just ends today, so okay. you have to go on today. But we've got some great all-in ticket specials. All oh, right. so you can go in there. All right, now some of the groups is coming up. What you got coming up for Christmas? Name one of the Well, we have a big holiday rock and yeah. soul show that we do. That's yeah. kind of our holiday theme show. We bring in some local bands. We try to bring in different bands every time. But this year, we've got Cornbread, yeah, the Paul local guys. Grimshaw yeah, yeah. Band, and Entrance. All are great local bands. They're party bands. You can come out. Like I said, bring your family and friends. You can get a great cheap ticket to get in the door and come out and just you know dance the night away to some of so, your favorite hits. Fantastic. Now, that one's on right after Christmas. They're Y'all all right, after, right Christmas. after Christmas. So we don't 27. have anything on Christmas Day, but we yeah. say the party doesn't stop. We party from Christmas through New Year's Eve. On New Year's Eve, we do have our dinner and dance with Chocolate Chip and Company in the restaurant. And we also have uh, Corey Smith live in nice. concert in the music hall. Everybody loves that show. Oh, wow. So those tickets are also available right now. You can um, plan for New Year's Eve. We say keep on rocking from Christmas right through New Year's Eve. <laughs> That I is great. It. All right, the House of Blues, they've also brought so many big name groups here also. Anything okay. coming for the new year that's any big names you might can throw we out? We have a few big shows coming. I know people are excited about the Avett Brothers show. Just There's about three to say, nights March. of Avett Brothers in March coming up. Yep. But we're still announcing some January and February shows. There's a few things on our calendar already. If you check it out online, um, just go through. Each month is up there, and you can okay. go through and see. But January, we've got some great shows, too. Now, on right. this Rock and Soul yeah. holiday show you guys are doing, um, you know, is it going to sell out quickly? Does it normally sell out quickly? What, what no, do we, what it's do we normally need? something where you can just bring all your family and friends and just come. come. Some people come, come and go, so there's different kinds of bands. Don't playing, worry so about the can... tickets ahead of time. Just come and have a no, great but time. If you want to get a cheap ticket, get it today online. That's right. Cyber That's right. Monday today. But yes, but you can come out even the day of and get a ticket and still join us for the. All right, now what night. time's that start? The rocket. Seven o'clock. I brought some tickets okay. here. Thank uh, you. But okay. The doors are open at eight, but we'll be rocking with three sets like that of the local bands. We'll be rocking till 11, 12 o'clock. So. People Love can come it. in early or come in late, and we'll be uh, partying, partying. Thank yeah. you, Dawn. Always yeah. something happened to the House of Blues, That's even right. Christmas stuff. All That's right. right, and I think we'll see yeah. you in a few weeks for some New Year's we'll celebration. New Year's Eve details <laughs> when I come back. That's yeah. right. Thanks, Dawn. Hey. Hey. All right. hey. Elvis is in the audience. No way. <laughs> I see you. I can't God. wait. We'll be right back.
And welcome back to Carolina and Company Live, talking about Christmas shows all along the area and legends in concert. That's this right. is where you see those that look and sound like the real entertainers. There's no pantomime in here. That's no, right. they straight to it. Because guess who's with us? Elvis. <laughs> <laughs> yes. That's right. All right, let's talk about legends in concert. First of all, how long have you been at legends in concert? Oh, this is going on my third year. All right, fantastic. And we've got Elvis with us right now. I mean, tell us about the experience. Is it a Christmas show? You guys do something special for Christmas? Well, what's really cool with our show now is the first half that we do before animation, we get the regular, the regular Legends in Concert show, which is all the entertainers doing the regular set. Right. Then the second half, we, uh, we take a break, 15-minute intermission, come back, and all of us interact and do the Christmas part of the show. That's wow, the fun that's part of it. Now, what, what are you doing during the Christmas part? What do you do? We do all the uh, the, the local, uh, the Christmas favorites. Uh, a couple of songs that I get to do is Mary Did You Know, Oh Holy Night. It's a good song. Uh, yeah, beautiful songs. Uh, of course, we do Blue Christmas. Yes, you can't do that without Blue Christmas, you're, right? You've you got to do that one. You know, so, uh, yeah, we, we all interact together and, and do a lot of songs, and it's, it's really a fun time. And I see you got Rob there that does uh, yeah. Rob Stewart. Yeah, yeah. Rob's here. He, I run into uh, him a couple of times. I get to do his hair every night, so that's <laughs> cool. he always asks me, you know. Now, where are you from originally? Now, Shelby, his real name North is Carolina. Travis Powell. Now, where are you from originally? Shelby, North Carolina. Up in Shelby, Shelby North Carolina. Carolina. Now, what were you doing before you came here? I've always been an entertainer. Okay. Yeah, I've been entertaining for the last 10 years. I have my own band, did country rock stuff. Cool. And, uh, yeah. yeah. So, uh, But I've always loved Elvis, uh, uh, Elvis since four years old. I've actually got a VHS tape of me doing Elvis at four years old. Really? Yeah. Really? Yeah. Little Sweet do you know we, that when you... We'd love to see that. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that'll be rolling in a few minutes. Right. Yeah. Surprise Hang to you. Hang on, everybody. <laughs> Just kidding. I'm yeah. a big Elvis fan, too. I've seen all his movies, all his documentaries and everything, and... Uh, it's just great. And when people get to come and see you do this, I mean, I, I, it's so neat for these people that see somebody that can do Elvis. Right. It's, uh, um, it's very humbling, um, to be honest with you. Uh, I've been an Elvis fan, like I said, since four years old. So to see people and see them smile and have a good time, that's what it's all about. You know, kind of take them back. For the people that got to see Elvis, yes. yeah. they, uh, they kind of go back in time. And for the people that didn't, they say, hmm, maybe that's what it was like. Maybe, yeah, pretty I cool. I saw him in Fayetteville at the Cumberland Auditorium. You're lucky dog. Yeah. Unbelievable. I mean, it was just uh, ladies that are older than I was trying to crawl on stage with him. Really? Yeah. When you walked out, you take your eyes off him because there's so many flash bulbs. Right. It was I, just, love it. I mean, it was amazing just to watch that. And, Absolutely. And he was so good back then, too. Oh, yeah. Yes, he was. Now, all right. of all time. All right, now let's tell who all you got on the show. You've got, uh, let's see, Rod Stewart. Oh, we've got a great lineup. we got uh, Blues Brothers. Right. We've got Rod Stewart, Dolly Parton. We have Nat King Cole and myself as Elvis. Yeah, well, wow. Nat King Cole, How where's awesome. he from? This guy that does Nat King I Cole. I think it's Las Vegas. Las Vegas? Okay. So you've got a great lineup. This is something families, friends, just get together, everybody, people in town, come in town and see this show because it's going to be a great way to celebrate a night with your family. Absolutely. Bring the family, uh, as many of them as you can. We appreciate it. <laughs> and the, and um, you go to find out more about it, you can go to where? What legendsinconcert.com. Okay. Uh, you okay. can go online there or you can call 843 843- Two three eight seven eight two seven. All right, now y'all doing any afternoon shows or mostly? Yes, we do. On Tuesdays we do two shows, two and eight, and for the next two Saturdays we also do a two and eight show. Okay. Oh, so so six want... nights a week, uh, Tuesdays and Saturdays for the next two weeks is two shows, and then yeah. after that it's just Tuesday. Which Plenty of opportunity, but absolutely opportunity. call the box office, get absolutely. your tickets now because you will fill up for Christmas. Absolutely. Yeah. Yes, All right. Do. It was right. so nice to meet you. Thank, thank you, you so, so much. much. I just want to say thank you. Thank you very much. That's my line. <laughs> I'm sorry, man. <laughs> I'll let y'all right. fix that. <laughs> All right. All right. We got a little more coming up. Stay with us. We'll be right back. And welcome back. Nice little 
you know, Christmas from Alabama Theater. Ornaments, yes. Thank yeah. you very much. That was a fun show. Yeah. I love Christmas, and I love getting to talk about the things that you can do here on the Grand Strand. Now, Thanksgiving. I wanted yeah. to, what'd you do? Uh, we had we went down to uh, Hanser House and had lunch. Took you went back. Down. Yeah, we went <laughs> down. Right. Great food. It was a, a great Thanksgiving down there. We picked our mother-in-law up and took her down there. So and she enjoyed it? Time. She enjoyed it. Then I went and bought a new TV over the weekend. Oh, good. Yeah, yeah. It, they installed it in my house. No. <laughs> <laughs> my wife said the one in the bedroom wasn't that clear, so I had to go buy another one. All right. Well, okay. that works. I went shopping on Friday afterwards, shopped all day long with my best friend. We had a fantastic time. Thanksgiving was good, too. We were at the beach condo. So That's right. Thanksgiving on the beach. And we gave thanks for everything, and we do appreciate everything that we received. And uh, I promise you, we're such a lucky people to live in America. That's right. That's Absolutely. Y'all have a great afternoon. See you tomorrow. See you have a great day. Carolina and Company Live is sponsored by the businesses, organizations, and groups featured in this program. The views and opinions expressed do not necessarily reflect that of WPDE ABC 15, WWMB CW 21, or its employees. And hello, everybody. Coming up in just a few minutes, Carolina and Company Live, we got Pet of the Day from the uh, Grand Strand Humane Society. That's be right. Here. We're also talking about barrel racing. It's coming to the Southeastern North Carolina Agricultural Center in Lumberton. It's going to be a lot of fun. That's right. And the Conway Rotary Club is getting ready for their Reindeer Run 5K. All right. And the bold and beautiful event that raises money for cancer victims. That is coming up. All that and more for your show on a Tuesday. We'll see you in a few minutes. Hello, everybody. It's Wednesday. Coming up in just a few minutes, Coastline Pets. Uh, Hello, everybody. It's Wednesday. Coming up in just a few minutes, Tommy's.